It's celebration time. Another time to induct the graduate of veterinary medicine from Faculty of Veterinary Medicine, University of Badon, the premier university, and the first Faculty of Veterinary Medicine in Nigeria. I am Professor Lufem Bolani Wadideji, the current dean of the Faculty of Veterinary Medicine. Like I said, it's a time to rejoice, to celebrate with our graduates. This set is unique because they are the 50th set to be inducted as veterinarian from this faculty. Actually, vet medicine started at the University of Ibadan in October 1963, and Professor Ikede was the first graduate. Induction commenced with varying degree of celebration each year. Vet medicine assisted with a mega department in the then Faculty of Agriculture as a sub-faculty. And Professor D.H. E. was the program coordinator. He later became the dean of the faculty in 1975. Since then, we've been growing. Since 1963, we've been producing graduate veterinarians for the country. And a lot of our products are doing well. We have some as vice chancellor, we have some as business guru, we have some in the banking industry. So, 50 years of induction is worth celebrating. Veterinary medicine program was introduced at the University of Ibadan in October 1963. That was the first time the first set of students, about nine or ten of them were admitted to the Federal University, and the first in the country. And then, at that time, there was an arrangement whereby the graduates, I mean the, the students, would be trained by the University of Ibadan in the preclinical clinical and para clinical and trained by the Amandu Bello Universities in the clinic. So these arrangements went on until about 1970 when it was terminated. The full clinical program started at Ibadan. So the Faculty of Veterinary Medicine was created in 1975. That was the year the Faculty of Veterinary Medicine was created. So veterinary medicine in Nevada have been graduating students since 1967 when the first graduate was produced, Dr. Ikede. He was jointly trained by the University of Nevada and Amandu Bello University. But he has a Bachelor of Veterinary Medicine degree program mm -hmm. awarded by the University of Nevada in 1967. So that's the first graduate. Since then, the Badan have been producing graduates increased from three per year to five to seven, now to about uh, 70 or 80 per uh, annum. So these are the, the, the volume of graduates being produced by Badan. I'm Professor Maladi Oladere, the Director of Veterinary Teaching Hospital, University of Badan. Now, talking about the Veterinary Teaching Hospital, that's the arm of the faculty that handles the clinical training of our students. The VTH, as we always usually call it, was established in 1981. And it uh, takes, it's a platform essentially for clinical training, for the DVM program, postgraduate program, and even the residency program of the College of Veterinary Surgeons Nigeria. And it's a tertiary health care giver, meaning that you have cases being referred from clinics outside, from the state hospitals. So with that, our students are exposed to a lot of cases that come from outside. We have uh, the avian, uh, the poultry clinic. We have the small animal clinic that handles dogs and cats. We have the large animal clinic for the other, mainly the farm animals. We have the preventive medicine clinic where we do handle uh, vaccinations and all. So being a tertiary healthcare provider, 
uh, we have concentration of cases, even the surgical cases coming in, and our students are so exposed in all of this. If after graduation, they also know that they have their backs being covered because they refer cases here. So that's essentially what we stand for. It, it allows the students to have their hands on. We provide clinical services for clients within the campus, outside the campus, even beyond Oyo State. They have cases that come in. So it's quite a busy hospital. They're still growing. And uh, we, are, we are really proud of the VTH we have because our students are really exposed. We have an area of specialists in the different uh, specialty areas and our students are able to go through all of this. So we are always usually assured that at the end of the day, our graduates, uh, they can perform after graduation. I'm Professor Matthew Dean, 2013 to 2017. Uh, on the occasion of 58th induction, I want to sincerely congratulate our students who soon become our colleagues. I want to appreciate God for, for them for successful completion of their course. It is a thing of joy for us to bring out another set of qualified veterinarians into the market and um, is is uh, well, I can assure everybody that this these people have worked so hard my advice to them is that you need to invest into yourself we have given you we have invested in you is now to invest in yourself so that things you have learned things you need to add you know when I was there they didn't teach me ultrasound I have to I have to learn it so you need to add to what you have learned so that on the feet you can you know bring the application to bear. My name is Anisulu Ashimi Sonoma, the immediate past president of Association of Veterinary Medical Students, University of Ibadan. I'm also privileged to be part of the inducting class, the 58th um, induction set. Um, we are really privileged in the class because uh, considering the training and the dreaming over the years, we are lucky to be a part of this set in that all of us are graduating together. The 79 of us who are, wrote the exam and we all passed the exam. It's really a privilege for us that an opportunity. And we also hope that as we are going outside there, we hope that opportunities are with us. You know, to give our, our do our best in every way we find ourselves. And we also hope that our lecturers will also be there to serve as mentors for us anytime we feel we need to get more knowledge from them. We appreciate everyone that has contributed to our success so far and we pray that the Almighty God will bless them. We appreciate our parents also for giving us this quality education.